What is silimonite? Silimonite is a mineral that is primarily composed of aluminum silicate. It is part of the larger family of minerals known as the silimonite group. Silimonite is a polymorph, meaning that it can exist in different crystal structures depending on the temperature and pressure conditions under which it forms. Its three polymorphs are known as kyanite, andalusite, and silimonite. Silimonite is a relatively rare mineral that is typically found in metamorphic rocks that have been subjected to high temperatures and pressures. It is commonly associated with other aluminum-rich minerals such as garnet, storolite, and kyanite. Silimonite is typically found in schists, gneisses, and granulites, which are rocks that have undergone significant amounts of heat and pressure during their formation. One of the unique properties of silimonite is its high melting point. Silimonite can withstand temperatures of up to 1,550 degrees Celsius without melting, which makes it an important industrial mineral for use in high temperature applications. It is often used as a refractory material in the manufacture of ceramics, glass, and metals. Its ability to resist high temperatures also makes it useful as an insulation material for high temperature furnaces and other industrial equipment. In addition to its industrial uses, silimonite is also prized by collectors and lapidarists for its unique crystal structure and attractive appearance. It is a translucent to opaque mineral that can occur in a range of colors, including brown, green, gray, and white. Its long, slender crystals make it a popular mineral for use in jewelry and other decorative objects. Overall, silimonite is a versatile and valuable mineral that has a wide range of industrial and decorative applications. Its unique properties make it an important component in many industrial processes, while its attractive appearance makes it a popular choice for collectors and jewelry designers. How is silimonite formed? Silimonite is a metamorphic mineral, meaning that it forms as a result of changes in temperature and pressure within the Earth's crust. It typically forms in metamorphic rocks such as schists, gneisses, and granulites, which have been subjected to high temperatures and pressures during their formation. The specific conditions required for the formation of silimonite depend on its polymorph, or crystal structure. Silimonite has three polymorphs, kyanite, andalusite, and silimonite. These three minerals have the same chemical formula, Al2CO5, but different crystal structures. Kyanite forms at high pressures and low temperatures, while andalusite forms at high temperatures and low pressures. Silimonite forms at high temperatures and high pressures. The formation of silimonite occurs through a process called metamorphism. This process involves the alteration of rocks under the influence of heat and pressure, which causes the mineral composition and texture of the rocks to change. Silimonite typically forms in rocks that have experienced regional metamorphism, which occurs over large areas and is usually associated with mountain building processes. During regional metamorphism, rocks are subjected to high temperatures and pressures over long periods of time. This can cause the minerals within the rocks to recrystallize and form new minerals. In the case of silimonite, the mineral forms from the breakdown and recrystallization of other minerals rich in aluminum and silica, such as andalusite and kyanite. As the pressure and temperature continue to increase, the aluminum and silica atoms rearrange themselves into the distinctive crystal structure of silimonite. Overall, silimonite formation is a complex process that occurs over long periods of time under the influence of intense heat and pressure. The specific conditions required for its formation depend on the polymorph, but it generally occurs in rocks that have undergone regional metamorphism. The resulting mineral is an important component in many industrial processes and is also prized for its attractive appearance. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications.